You know, honest to God, I don't remember what the cliffhanger was. I don't remember what situation our characters are in. Because this game's pretty dull. That is a painting of the background. Oh, okay, I remember, yeah, there's a helicopter crash. That was an old doom noise, wasn't it? The helicopter crashing was like the door opening noise in Doom. It's okay. I think we're okay. Oh my god, those poor people. I hope they're dead. Uh we're lucky that chopper didn't kill us all. <laughs> I don't feel so lucky. I really love whenever you start a, a level and it just gives you an achievement for absolutely no reason. God, you're trying to bring the tower down. It'll hold. It's got to. Yeah, well, I don't want to take any chances. Let's see, where's the... We're gonna have to sacrifice one of you as bait. Yeah, hey, we'll be up, honey. I want to go home. I know, sweetheart. Me too. We'll be fine. I promise. We need to get off the tower before the raptors bring it down. The emergency ladder's right there. The way the tower is tilting, it will put us down outside the paddock. Well, that's a start, but the fence isn't much of an obstacle for the raptors. Where do we go once we're out? Maybe that big if giant fucking door? Tunnels, right over there. We can lock the raptors out if we can beat them inside. I hope you're right. Let's get that ladder lowered. Yeah, I feel like that's not gonna work. The raptors are way too fast. I want to get this dad killed so bad. I want to get everyone except the the little girl killed. How you holding up, honey? I want to go home. Oh, I know, no, sweetheart. Not again. Too. We'll be fine. I promise. Now he's made that promise twice. That should free it up. Okay, whatever you say, buddy. Good. <laughs> Brand new, so it might still be a little stiff. Maybe if you put more weight on it. What? You mean stand on it? Yes, ride it down. Okay, but we should probably be ready to move as soon as it comes down, so we can stick together. All right, then the little girl should Wait, go on listen, my back. I want you to be ready to climb down the ladder as soon as it's extended. Okay, Dad. You're good. Sorkin. I'll be right down. Doubt it. She's dead. It's really stuck. Oh no, I see the problem. The whole ladder is just slightly bent. It can't slide freely. We might be able to force it. Must have been the crash. Looks what? That way. I think we're gonna need a. The helicopter was nowhere oh, near the ladder. Get creative, because there are no tools up here. Oh, there's a few tools up here. Uh, up top, I guess. See, this is another area where there should be a timer. This antenna could be just the thing we need to pry the ladder open. It's an antenna. If I try to grab it now, I could get electrocuted. Do it. Die, you son of a bitch. Ow, damn it. Yep, it's live. I love that in the reality that. of this game, this dude said, "Well, if it's if I try and grab it now, it'll just electrocute me." And then he grabbed it anyway. Turning this off. Do you think the others are okay? I Maybe sweetheart. selected nothing. We get our hopes up. My hopes are that they're dead. Sorkin, that antenna is the only thing up here I've seen that we can use to pry the ladder open. Is there any way to turn the power to those lights off so I can grab it? Not from up here. The aircraft alert beacons aren't ever supposed to be disabled. The best I can do is make them flash on and off. Oh boy, ah, we got a I timing can puzzle them here. I nighttime to daytime operation. They shine continuously at night, but during the day they flash to provide more contrast. So do it then. Oh, of course, I've got to control her. Boop. Okay, I've switched the beacon lights to daytime mode. Hopefully that wire won't be live while the lights flash off. I don't. Th it's probably always live. Got it. Wait. So it wasn't attached to anything. Why? Why was it live? 
If I couldn't move it by jumping on it, I'm never going to be able to pry it by myself. Dr. Sorkin? Yes? Can you give me a hand with this? You pry while I put my weight on the ladder. Certainly. Certainly. Okay, Dr. Sorkin, I'm ready. Jess, honey, you get ready to move as soon as the ladder I really hope that down. they give me an option ready, to play Dad. this part and Just then hurry. I can uh, make okay, him like, fall Sorkin. down. On three. Ready? Because that's One, the most enjoyment two, that I'm going to get three. out of this game right now is getting this dad hurt in, in numerous ways. Uh, you've got to be freaking kidding me. Dad, what are we going to do? Try again. On three. Well, I don't like the sound of them One, apples, Will. What are we going to do? Two. Three. No, just wait. What the no. fuck? What the hell just happened? It looked like she jumped off. You know, she's dead. There's almost no chance of her surviving this. Damn it! Fuck me, why did I... I'm so used to just, like, pressing the button that I did it. I bet he, he, she could have landed on him. No, she's dead. There's no way she's making it out of the scene. Come on, they're right behind you. Who am I controlling here? That was bad then. Okay. Oh, that's not funny. Thanks. Okay, now up and over. I'm okay. The animation was the same, only she said I'm okay. That's actually really disappointing. That like the dad didn't get hit. There's no way this is gonna close fast enough. Oh okay, yep, never mind. I thought it wasn't timed at all. See, I'm too curious in these kinds of games, so that, that's always a detriment when playing these. Because I'm always like, well, what happens if I just don't press anything here? Absolutely thrilling. A more thrilling video game has truly never been made. Oh, of course, these two bozos are still alive. Next time I get a headache like this, there better be tequila involved. No way. Shut up. This turned out better than the last time you drank tequila. Yeah, you might be right. The girl I woke up next to is prettier anyway. <laughs> so, we lost our ride, and the only person we managed to rescue so far doesn't even work for InGen. Now what? See if you can find anything useful in the wreck. And make sure the girl's okay while I scout the perimeter. Ah, damn it. I left my AK inside the chopper. It's probably toast. Glad I didn't leave a round chambered. Could have killed someone. That That's a detail that, like, no one needed. Still, the cook-off was a hell of a show. Like, that sounds like a writer was like, What happens if, if a live round is in gun when in fire? I should and then they were like, oh, well, okay. to be realistic, I, I better mention that. It's like no one ne needed that. It's not information that is important at all. Oscar might want to talk to her when she wakes up. Let's postpone that little reunion. I'm supposed to check on her, not stand over her and make a quip. This is great. I'm glad I can look over here. Wait, why did he move his hand that one time? Was that just like a weird animation? Are we gonna have like a Jurassic Park 3 kind of thing on our hands? I have a can just like this back in San Jose. Where like dinosaurs are gonna start to chase her? Heavier than I remember. Could just be full, I guess. What an idiot. God, I hate this guy. I hate all these characters, every single one of them. Sounds half empty, feels full. 
Why is that? My stepbrother used to store his second set of keys in a fake pop can. I wonder. See, this one's not even fun. Well, like, you can't even, like... Stash. Oh, God, he's got a what really bad case it? of the Capcom fingers. That shaving cream can is some pretty nice handiwork. Just who the hell are you working for, lady? Dodson. But yeah, like... It, it's a bad example, maybe, but Heavy Rain, like, was a lot of fun in the way that you could just be really, really dumb... Like, you can have Ethan stand at his fridge staring at a carton there. of orange juice for like an hour. He can shake it and shake it wrong. Better keep checking her out. If she's gonna blow, we don't want to be anywhere nearby. You talking about the girl again or the helicopter? Gonna take more than an auxiliary power unit to fix her this time. Looking pretty safe. One more look, just to be sure. Looking pretty safe? Wait, what am I looking for? No fuel left. Must have been a hell of a blast. I forget if this video is going up on Thursday or Friday. But if it's Thursday, it means I'm going to see the Jurassic World movie tonight. And I can't wait to actually have a good Jurassic Park experience. Because this game is not doing it. I really figured that this game would be like a thousand times better than it was, than it is. But I am not impressed. Damn it, Oscar. Wait, why is the T-Rex like Blair witching those trees in the back? Chopper's not gonna blow, but just about everything in it, including our weapons, is flame broiled. No game trails, no nests. This is base camp for now. But you, you like you guys noticed the like overturned trees and stuff, right? That means that big dino comes through here every now and then. Oh my god. That was so, the worst look I've ever plan. seen. That shaving cream can looks like some real CIA stuff. What do you think she's up to? Ask her when I ain't around. If she won't tell you, I'll make her talk my way. We gonna try to salvage this gig? Yeah. I'm gonna go look for our friends. Uh, shouldn't I come with? We no. lost the guns. Means I gotta be in stealth mode. <laughs> you saying I can't sneak? I'm saying I doubt he can shut his mouth long enough to her sneak. At the same time. Besides, she won't talk with me around. But maybe pretty boy Billy can get her to open up. Yeah, it's a tough job. I, I literally want a T-Rex to come in and, and kill every single one of these characters. Really? The Velociraptors? Oh, okay, they're trying to open the door, gotcha. Dios mio. They open doors. Because I was going to say, I don't understand why the Velociraptors aren't just, uh, like, leaving. Me and that Velociraptor made eye contact for, like, a good five seconds. In bed. Maybe don't talk out loud, you big dope. Damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to be stealthy, the last thing you want to goddamn do is yell out loud, damn it. Why are there so many velociraptors? Like just in the in the, the reality of the movie, I'm pretty sure that oh well now I'm pretty sure that's gonna No, I thought that was gonna kill me. There were only three Velociraptors. And they died. Well, they died slash one got stuck in a, uh, freezer. Okay, so that's a no-go. Oh yeah, go up the stairs, duh. Go under the stairs, duh. This is so stupid. This is incredibly dumb. This is, like I was saying before, could this have just been an animated movie? Yeah. This part, there's no gameplay. You're just pressing buttons. 
All the other Telltale games I've played are immensely better than this. Gerard. Wait, what? I I really hope he just knocks on the door. We're not buying what you're selling. Not smart enough, because apparently the Velociraptors just got in the front door and are probably just going to walk around. So we're going to Resident Evil this now. Hopefully it's Code Veronica, where the knife is overpowered and not like Resident Evil 7, where it's not very useful. I am feels real. How am I not bad? Speaking of Resident Evil, well, A, she's floating. B, the Resident Evil 2 remake looks amazing. I can't stop thinking about it, and I want to play that game more than anything right now. Leave me alone. Idiotas. At least one of them pulled me out of there. Not sure I'd do the same. Nice. Great character, then. Uh... Looks like I was only out for a little while. The embryo should be okay for now. She looks like a Muppet when she talks sometimes. There's no, like, prompt on screen for change anything. I hope the game didn't glitch. Where's the cane? Nieta! No, no, no! Is she that scared because the... The landscape was like Looking glitching. This? Why is That's he in a tree? Mine. You know, this takes me back. I learned to shave with this stuff. Give it back now. I'm all out of shaving cream myself. You mind if I borrow some? I wonder if Stop they shaking. had to get the license well, from Barbasol to again. It you use it. it says so right on the can. You want to tell me what's so important about shaving cream, or do I ask Injun? Uh, I will do this one because maybe it'll be entertaining. It, it was my lover's. He died fighting for the revolution in Chile. It's all I have of his. Please give it back. Oh, that is so sweet. So let me get this straight. Your Marxist revolutionary Whoa, boyfriend this turns made into like an Alex Jones thing. Your Marxist revolutionary you. boyfriend. He must have been a very sensitive guy. I ain't stupid, lady. You want to try again? Embryos. They're dinosaur embryos. If you drop them, they'll be destroyed. Look, Yoder. Philly, right? Maybe we can make a deal. This ought to be good. Shoot. What the fuck? I'm gonna There's just a lot appeal of money to his you, greed. If I get those embryos to my contact before they go bad. You turn that over to Injun. You get a pat on the back. Maybe a little Christmas bonus. You leave it to me, you become a rich man. Pay off your debts, quit your job. No more guys in suits telling you what to do. Just think about it. Okay. Keep talking. Seriously, her and the little girl are the only characters Please. that are actually somewhat like good in this game. Me, but the right thing to She's do not is annoying. Get it back to me She's not quipping when she shouldn't be. Must I reveal my daughter? Fuck, none of these are good. One mercenary to another. Would you do any different in my place? Everyone come win here. Let your friends save those people while we sell the embryos. Look, lady, we both have jobs to do. Thing is, in this situation, I'm the cop and you're the robber. The fuck, must I reveal my daughter is the worst prompt. I've ever seen in a game, and he's floating too. He's not gonna care about his her people's plight. I have a daughter. I need the money to get her out of the ghetto. Oh boy. You know what happened to the there. Chicago she morning, and a little baby boy is real? born in the ghetto. Come on, Billy. The money's good. Is a baby boy or baby child? Me save my daughter. Everybody gets a little something. Okay, here's the deal. 
One, I'm in charge. I keep the embryos, and as soon as it's safe to break away, we'll deliver them to your contact. I don't know if the embryos will last in there much longer. That's a risk we're gonna take. Two, we're cutting Oscar in. No. Why? Because he's my partner, that's why. It'll be fine. Trust me. Now sit uh, tight and lighten stupid. up. Stupid. Not every woman gets to enjoy the sunset on a tropical island with Billy Yoder. Shut up, fall out of that tree, you cock. Have the clouds always been this pixelated? <laughs>